to the right, isn't it? Yeah. The facilities block. Just there. And it's a nice drive over grate, so that's good. But you've got water, wastewater, fresh water, a max view aerial. And these are the ones that you have to press the breakers in to switch them on. Okay, Trev, how much was this site? Well, from memory, Bob, <laughs> it's a hundred and... So in this video, we're heading to Poolsbrook, Caravan and Motome Club site. If you're approaching it from the south. Yeah, up on the A1, aren't we, at the moment? Yeah. We're just going to be turning off A57 towards Sheffield. used to turning left there, wouldn't we? I oh, know, going to plumb apart. Keep right to A619, then keep left. Keep left on A619. So we're just coming off the M1 northbound. Southbound. We're southbound? Yeah. Just coming off the M1 southbound. At the roundabout, take the third exit to A6192. And we're heading to Bullsbrook Caravan and Motorhome Club site. Complicated looking roundabout coming up here. We're going towards Staveley. Oh, Staveley, yeah, okay. I've been here once before? Twice, I think. Is that? Yeah. Came once on the way to the um, show at Peterborough. Okay. I went to the Tramway Museum. And then I think we had a stop over here once, a few years ago. At the roundabout, Take the third exit to A6192. I'm going in there. Oh, they're all going on moats, why aren't they? Yeah. Sign for it, then. Yep. Straight on. And we'll follow the brown signs just in case. Yeah. This is sat next. I've got it right. Yeah, she's got it right. Yeah. Turn left onto Pavilion Drive. Oh, 
de Andalusia. Quite a steep I mean, hump there, isn't there? cafe there isn't there yeah don't think we've ever been here when it's been open but <laughs> we're here at a weekend, weekend so. yeah so I might stand more of a chance That's arrivals to the right, isn't it? Yeah. We've got that bikes here. Yeah. On a service pitch, we tra treated ourselves to a service pitch. Yeah. Trev's just pulled in behind us. Yeah, I can see. here shortly after it opened didn't we? We did yeah in that little bailey so it's that was the first time. I think Poppy was just a puppy then. Well our, our bailey? Yeah. Our compact bailey. Yeah but compact bailey yeah. yeah. And then we, I, Jenny I think we do we go around here just yeah 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 to the left. To the left. Can you just check this? Just, Do we go up here? Still puzzled, are we? We're still puzzled, yeah. Yeah, we've got to go all the way around. No, I think we've got to go all the way around. Yeah. yeah. I think we stopped there, that pitch there. That's the very first pitch we had here, yeah. yeah so got a photo or something. Could go here and here, couldn't we? Yeah, could do. Might be logical, wouldn't it? We'll get on that one. Straight opposite. Or oh, there's two next two to each down. other. Yeah. Yeah. Further down. Sure. Well, that's a bit of an angle, that one, isn't it? Is it? So should we go in here and let them go this in one? there? Yeah. Yeah. All right, Poppy. All right. Nearly there. Row, row, row. <laughs> row, row, row. I drove around the inside of the site earlier when we got here, so I think we'll try to show you around the outside here. There's not a lot of people here to be perfectly honest. Thought it'd be a bit busier, and it is a Saturday today, so it is very quiet. Mind you, it's the beginning of February. We've got a um, bin area here, the bins, and a chemical waste point. If I'm honest, I think that some of the pitches have got quite a bit of grass growing through them. It's quite surprising. Someone's left their electricity lead plugged in there, and gone out. Bam. I'm going to go right round the outside here. We've got the toilet uh, block and shower facilities to the left here. Another bin point. 
here. They've got these great big bins. Presumably, you just it just says general waste, so everything goes in there. And there's a separate one for glass, so that's not too bad. We're down there on the left. It's not a huge site. So it's about eighty odd pitches. There's the Wi-Fi point there, uh, next to another bin point and uh, another chemical waste point. And that's basically the site. Oh no, there's a little bit in the middle here. Let's do that. Yeah, so just go over here. Yeah, because the motorhome waste point, the uh, motorhome service point is just at the front of the, uh, the facilities block. Just there. And it's a nice drive over grate, so that's good. to the other other pitches there. Yeah, so that's it. Fairly logically laid out. So we're going to go out today. So you'll see that in the next video. Uh, we'll do a conclusion on this site after that. Well, these are the ones I think you've got to yeah, yeah, put it that one, that one. Right. Insert plug, lift flat and push breaker up to turn power on. Okay. Ah, it's just a little bit stiff. Oh, it must be that one. Oh, all right. A bit stiff. So you've got water, uh, wastewater, fresh water, a max view aerial, and these are the ones that you have to press the breakers in to switch them on. We're on a service pitch. Yeah, so that's the exit over there, reception's over there, and uh, toilet blocks are just there. Uh, yeah, so I think these service pitches must be relatively new because it looks like they've been digging up the grass to uh, put the services in. Yeah. Yeah, so that's the site map. We're on service pitch, what are we on, what are we on 50? on them, eh? 44. 44. All right, so we're there. Toilet block, reception, and okay, and then you go out to the campsite and the walks are up there somewhere. Yeah, walks are up there. Well, you can go out the front where we came in, can't you? Yeah, or you can go down, down the road along there and the lakes over there, more walks that way.
I like these photos here. <clears throat> the view from the pit head. Okay. And that was a view from caravan side to the pit head. That's looking towards the caravan side. Like it said that the site itself opened in 2008 and the Motomes Club site stands close to the site of the Island Kari, opened in 1875, had a ventilation shaft for nearby Hort Hort Hartington Kari, and the shaft was 423 feet deep. The peak of its, at its peak, Island Kari employed 620 men underground and 620 on the surface, and it closed in 1988. Wow. So over a hundred years pumping engines, headstock at Island Colliery in 1987. And the ironworks at Staveley produced seven. 100,000 tonnes per year in 1884. Wow. And it was producing TNT <laughs> and the ironworks. Loads of history here. And the usual leaflets and books, more local books. Yeah. Nice, brilliant. Right, pups. Yeah, we've just come for a walk down by the lake here. Uh, was down here with Poppy earlier, and uh, just brought Trav and Sue down here. And it's very nice too. I don't know how close I can get to these doves. Coming. There we go. Oh, it's a big yawn. Hey, hello, Rose. Alright. Okay, Trev, how much was this site? Well, from memory, Bob, <laughs> it's £102. Right, okay. For three nights, and that's on a service, service pitch. pitch. Yeah. yeah. So we've got water and uh, electricity and waste. Uh, water disposal, yeah. and the the surface pictures look quite new to me. I, the, everything was, uh, um, you know, pretty brand new. The yeah. uh, electrics and all of that. I think they just put them in, yeah, because they, they dug up some of the grass and that. Yeah, so, yeah. Um, toilets and showers. Have you you've used the shower? Have you? Been over to yeah a couple of times to yeah. use the showers, and uh, as always, you know, uh, car Carol Motor Home Club standard, and. Um, there's no press button on the showers. No, <laughs> which, which there was at Wagtail, obviously. There was, yeah, yeah. and uh, that's just nice to, uh, on these cold nights, to go over there and have a nice hot shower. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah. I think, that, I know, it's, they're still fairly new. I think they must be about seven years old, the shower hmm. block, something like yeah, that. Yeah, it's, it's a little bit different shape building to what we're used to, yeah. um, but still, probably, nevertheless. You probably see it over there. Yeah, yeah that's all right, yeah. yeah. Uh, quite modern uh, facilities there. Yeah. And you needed a key to get in. Um, that's right. Because we're quite near to. Uh, yes, as I found out when I went there at six o'clock in the morning the other. <laughs> that's right. Yeah, we're near to civilization here, so yeah. the toilet block's locked. Yeah, and obviously we've got the country park as well. Yep. Um, there are some laundry uh, facilities there as well. I think I did film those. Yeah. 
and a washing up room in there. I didn't see a family room or anything like that. Sometimes these places have family room. Mm -hmm. Probably probably in there somewhere. And the information point's just in the reception area, I think. Did you, do you look in there? I haven't been there yet. Um, no. I will be going in there when we go back. Yeah, because there's all sorts of things about walks like we're on at the moment. So, yep. uh, and a little bit of history of the area. Yeah, there's a very interesting picture. I'll have to see if I can get it of the what this place was like yep. um, when it was a colliery. <laughs> yep. Oop. That's all right. Oscar's found a friend. <laughs> yeah, there's no shop here either. That was the other thing. I, I didn't. <laughs> no, I wondered whether they high season they might have a few bits and pieces in there. Yeah. Um, but they hadn't got any uh, fluid or anything like that, had they? No. No. He um, said it, it, they're on there just for a six week contract. The uh, the um, site managers. Oh right. And I think that's probably not worth their while setting up a shop there. Uh huh. Uh, maybe maybe in the summer, like you say. Yeah. Uh, Motome service point. I, I think I actually missed where that was. It's, Sue it's pointed it out because she said, do you want to go and get some water from the Motome service point? All oh, right. Um, we're on a service pitch. Oh, it's right, I know. It's right in front of the uh, toilet. Uh, it's, that's right. Block, yeah, isn't it? Yeah. yeah, very okay. good. Um, yeah. With a drive over Yeah. Uh, as well, which is really good. Idea. Yeah. Uh, what, 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 uh, that's a dog, dog walk. Well, there's no shortage of walks no. here, is there? As soon as you come out of the gate, um, you're straight onto the country park. Yeah. And there's lots of made up paths. Yeah. Um, and uh, easy to find somewhere to walk. I, I always get asked this question is, is it wheelchair friendly? Um, yes. Yeah, and there I is also so. a disabled um, area in the facilities block. That's right. Right, and I, I think obviously some of the paths here, like this one, is pretty pretty even. So if you've got a powered wheelchair yeah. or something like that, yeah. you'd be all right. Right down to the lake, actually, wasn't it? Yeah, so, yeah, uh, it's fine. And there's uh, water and the chemical disposal points all around the site, so yep. that's good. Bus stops. That was I, I. I always forget to look at bus stops. So yeah, now there is. Um, we're just off, uh, we have to come through the industrial estate to get to the country park. Yeah. And I think you'd, for buses, they would be on the main road, Bob. So yeah. that would probably be about a five to ten minute walk. Right. Oh, that's uh, and that is the main road into the next town, isn't into it? Into Stavely, yeah, that's right. Into Stavely. It's, it's not too far to walk into Stavely either, so that's it's quite easy. Yep. You, you said about the signal strength. I mean, you've got an O2 on your phone, haven't you? O2 has been fine. Uh, I've got yeah. full 4G. It uh, did fluctuate a little bit, yeah. um, but um, it's good enough to you know, stream some videos. Yeah, and upload, yeah. yeah. Stream and upload. We could no, do that. That's good. That's good. Um, All right. Well, I hope you enjoyed this ending. It might be a little bit different. Yeah. <laughs> if you're wondering where Jenny is, <laughs> she's chatting away over there to Sue. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, you want to give them a wave? Okay. Can we say it? Bye. 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 Thanks for watching. <laughs> Bye. See you.